Today I'm gonna be teaching you how to install better Minecraft for Minecraft. It's me from the future. There was some issues while installing this mod pack and I'm going to teach you how to fix those issues and be able to play it. So make sure you watch the video until the end. Better Minecraft is a mod pack for Minecraft that has over 210 mods, making Minecraft and the play experience way, way better. Better Minecraft is what we like to call what Minecraft was supposed to be, right? It, this is like Minecraft 2.0. Now I hate making intro super long, so let's get right into the tutorial. For step number one, we're going to click the first link in the description, which will bring you to the website called Download curseforge.com. Here we're going to download curseforge. What is curseforge? You might ask. Curseforge is a launcher that will allow you to play mod packs and many other mod packs, not just better Minecraft, without having to go through their websites and downloading a bunch of stuff and so making it super complicated. That's why I love curseforge. I'm going to go ahead and download for Windows because obviously I have a Windows computer. The download should start immediately down here in the bottom left. You can see the file. Go ahead and click on that file. When you click in the installer, a menu is going to pop up. That menu doesn't get recorded by Streamlabs, but it's pretty much going to ask you if you allow this app to run in your computer go ahead and click yes curseforge is completely safe it has like over 10 million users so don't worry about it now this is how the installer is gonna look like if for some reason the installer didn't show on your bottom left of your browser when you downloaded it go ahead and go to your downloads folder and it should be the most recent file anyways once you open the installer this is what it looks like go ahead and select your language obviously it's english for me because i already struggle in english imagine any other language then you click next now here in this menu we're going to select the installation folder for me i'm gonna leave it as default you could go ahead and change it if you want Obviously, you have to click that you have read and accepted the terms and do not create a desktop shortcut for Overwolf. Overwolf is going to be installed with Curseforge. That is just the owner of Curseforge and it must be installed for Curseforge to run. Go ahead and give it around a minute. It's usually fast. It also depends on your computer and how fast it is. But overall, it's not a very long installation time. Once the launcher has finished installing, it will open this website. Do not click on it. You could go ahead and close it. And now we could either launch right here or we could close that and launch it from the desk right here. Curseforge, as you can see, preparing for source launch. If this is the first time you're opening, it might take longer than usual. It usually doesn't take this long. Just go ahead and launch it. Now, after a couple seconds, Curseforge is going to open. It's going to give you a little intro. After that, it's going to give you a little tutorial. I'm going to go ahead and skip that because we want to get it straight to the point. Now, here you're going to see a bunch of games. Do not click any other game because the mod pack we're looking for is Minecraft. Go ahead and click on Minecraft. Now, you see that I have a bunch of mod packs. That is because I already had Curseforge before. For you, this should be completely empty and you're going to click Browse Mod Packs. Usually, usually better Minecraft is on the top. So you could scroll a little bit down and you should find better minecraft right here as you can see but we don't know where better minecraft will be when you're watching this tutorial so go ahead and click search for mod packs and go ahead and type better minecraft as you can see when we press enter we get a bunch of different better minecraft we get better minecraft for forge for fabric different versions as you can see this one is 1.16.5 this one is 1.18.2 i'm going to be downloading the forge version because in my opinion that one is better than any other one it has more mods it runs better that's just my opinion but hey everybody got different opinions and obviously i'm going to be using the 1.18.2 because come on who doesn't love the new world generation go ahead and click install it shouldn't take that long obviously it's a lot of mods just give it some time in the meantime you could go ahead and search for other mods i mean you got our craft you got pixel mod there's a lot of other mods and curseforge is just amazing because of the amount of mod packs that it brings to you from the click of a button i mean it's so easy to install you don't have to go through the headache of adding a bunch of mods manually don't worry about that curseforge makes it easy now as you can see it's installing 185 mods now this is the version for 1.18.2 which has a little bit less mods than 1.16.5 but that is because 1.18.2 minecraft already made up for the missing mods in the better minecraft 1.18.2 i don't know if i explained myself properly i hope i did go ahead and click play once the installation has finished this will launch minecraft now right here you're gonna have a signing screen i don't get that because i'm already signing and this is where you're gonna put your minecraft obviously your java edition minecraft account go ahead and sign in and it will bring you over here to this screen right here you have two options you could go ahead and click play as you can see better minecraft is already selected or you could go to installations click on the folder right here go to mods and drop optifying 1.18.2 because optifying does not automatically come with the mod packs installed through curseforge so you could go to the optifying website download 1.18.2 and drop that into the folder so later on you could have shaders and make the game look even better as for now we're not gonna add optifying we're just gonna click play when you click play you're gonna get this warning right here you're always going to get that warning unless you click i understand the risk go ahead and click play it's completely safe i've been playing mod packs for the longest time ever give it some time to load because better minecraft is one of the most heavy mod packs for minecraft but i mean it's one of the best ones so we have to understand that there's a lot of mods that need to be downloaded after like a minute or so the minecraft launcher will close by itself and minecraft will open do not click anything just let it load as i said it's a lot of mods so it's going to take a little bit to load look at this it already looks beautiful guys just even the loading screen looks amazing just let it fully load i mean they updated the loading screen which is amazing it used to be like just a red screen and kind of ugly but now it looks beautiful it looks like you're playing actual minecraft 2.0 so let's just let it load now just to show you guys real-time feedback
feedback. Look at this. I got an error while installing the mod pack. Now, don't worry. If you get this error, I'm going to show you how to fix it. What this is saying right here is that one of the mods in the mod pack couldn't load. Therefore, I cannot launch the mod pack. And that mod is Enlighten N. Now, we have two options here. We could either delete this mod and let the mod pack load with no problems, or we could go ahead and fix this problem so we could have that mod loaded and not missed out on the full experience. Let's go ahead and press F11 to minimize the game and we could go ahead and close it, okay? Because we're going to fix that mistake so you could play better mod pack. Now, if your game loaded up with no problems, you're good. You could close the tutorial right now and go ahead and play. But if you had the same problem as me, let's go ahead and fix it. What you want to do is click on the second link of the description of this video, which will bring you to this website to download the newest version of Java. Minecraft 1.18.2 needs the newest version of Java to run mods, okay? So what we're going to do is update Java in our Windows computer. Make sure you select the Java 18 on this website, right? You click on that link, come over here, Java 18, click Windows because that's what we have and go ahead and download the installer for Windows. Make sure it's just the installer. You don't want the compressed file or the MSI installer. Regular installer, go ahead and click download and let's wait for that to download. It should start immediately. Once you see this little cop right here, that means that it has loaded. Go ahead and click on it. We could go ahead and close the website already and let's go through the installer. It's going to ask you for permission. Go ahead and click yes, just like before. Then just click next, next and let it install pretty much. As we can see, Java 18 has been fully installed. Go ahead and close it. Now we could go back to CurseForge, click on play one more time. Let the Minecraft launcher update. We just installed the new Java, so it's going to take a little bit, just like a couple seconds. Don't worry. Once Minecraft launcher has opened, you should be signing already. So don't worry about that. Go ahead and click play one more time. Obviously, this process should be faster since we already did it once. Everything should be loaded up. No problem. And let's just wait for the game to open. I'm going to keep the game minimized because when I put it on full screen, the recording software that I use to record this gives me like some problems and it gets like black screens. So let's just keep it minimized for the tutorial. You could go ahead and press F11 and have it full screen. Don't worry about that. Let's see if we were able to fix it. And as you can see, it's loading. I mean, it's taking some time, but there we go. We're finally in better Minecraft. We could go ahead and click single player, multiplayer. Now, if this comes up, make sure you allow access because if you don't, the game might crash. It has happened that the game crashes because you didn't allow access. Now, let's go to single player just to see if it works. Let's name this subscribe because I know you're going to subscribe because I just fixed your problem. And now let's go ahead and click create new world. Let's give it some time because it's the first time we're launching it. It says not responding, which is a bit scary, but don't worry because I know that it's going to fully load. Don't click anything. Don't click out of it because if not, it's just going to crash the game and you're not going to be able to play it. As you can see, it takes a little bit. It's a lot of mods loading. Do not click anything. I repeat, a lot of people freak out when it says not responding or stuff like that. Do not click anything. Just let it load. It's a lot of mods. And this is the 1.18.2 version, which is the newest one. It is still encounters some issues, some problems. You shouldn't get any trouble after we updated Java to the 18th. But hey, if you get any problems, any errors, make sure to leave them down in the description so I will be able to help you or anybody from the community might be able to help you as well. Now, the game is almost loaded. It has taken me around a minute to load and I have a very good computer, so it might take you longer or even less. And now we can see we're finally in the game. Better Minecraft has been fully installed. I'm going to go ahead and look, increase the size so you can see that it's better Minecraft. As you can see, it fully works. So you can move around. Look at the skeleton horse. And as you can see, it's me. It's my character. This is not a recording that I stole from somebody. This is me. It's Cuba. If you enjoy the content and the way I speak to the camera and stuff and you want to see me play live, go ahead and follow me on that purple YouTube. You know, the purple YouTube, you know, it's it's Cuba. Just, just look me up. It's Cuba. You could also click on the link in the description so you could watch me play live. And as always, bye bye.